Even the best contingency plan can fail. The biggest hurricane can wipe that plan out. It can wipe out the power grid. It can wipe out your stockpile of medicines. The only way to ensure that they're gonna get what they need is to have it there before the hurricane hits. The Hurricane Preparedness Program is the biggest emergency prep program direct relief runs. When a disaster hits, community health centers are the places where people are gonna go for care. You put in a series of interventions from backup power to backup reliable communications to a stockpile of medications, access to mobile medical units and off-road vehicles to get to patients who might be stranded. You can start to put in place the things you need that hopefully no matter how big the hurricane is, they're gonna be able to stay open. The Hurricane Preparedness Pack was initially built by the health centers themselves who told us this is what we wished we had had in place when this hurricane hit. It's the 200 most essential items that any health center would need to treat their patients in a time of crisis. Unlike other natural disasters, hurricanes are predictable in the sense that there's a season and there's a geography where they hit. Direct Relief has mapped out the last 50 years of category four and five hurricanes to see where they make landfall. We've now strategically positioned these hurricane modules along the Gulf Coast and the Eastern Seaboard and internationally. Direct Relief has invested in hurricane preparedness and resiliency efforts so that the next time a hurricane hits, we can ensure these clinics will be self-sustaining so that they can do what they do best, which is treating these patients and giving them access to the medicines and the care that they need.